Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Workers and Republic Soviet Resources, where things are sort of kind of ambling along as we come into winter in 1985. Yeah, this is the Lucky Corners uh, map where I have uh, accumulated loads of confusion over the time. And yeah, and it's winter. Now, uh, where we're at, uh, there's uh, several uh, shortish term loans that are about to expire, and that's going to definitely improve the cash flow uh, as soon as they do. Uh, you know, so there's that. Uh, but what's uh, happening, if I bring up the underground here, uh, I'm building uh, some water pipe to bring treated water um, up to, whoops, nope, I lost it, um, up to uh, Irontown, right? So we got all the way up here, all the way over here, all the way up here, right? Um, this mess here, I had a different thought about what I was going to do. Uh, I may still do that uh, that thing, uh, but who knows? Anyway, uh, yeah, as the you know as things get constructed up here, uh, it gets uh, more and more uh, to the point where uh, uh, we'll be able to start you know making steel. Well, that's still a little way off, right? Uh, although the uh, rail construction business is basically done for now and uh, we're just uh, building the infrastructure stuff up here which uh, it's gonna take a while uh, even if I uh, uh, it took a few tricks to speed that up now once the uh, the loans here retire uh, once the uh, once I can get ahead on the rubles here like the owing rubles business here um, I might just uh, turn off uh, realistic mode and uh, allow switch to allowing construction since it's reasonably clear that uh, I can so I can uh, manage the construction if need be, right? Uh, but what I want to uh, what I want to talk about, though, uh, is that uh, there's a new uh, patch coming, uh, an update. Uh, it's in beta now. Uh, I don't think it's quite ready for prime time, uh, so I'm not going to switch to the beta just yet. Um, as I understand it, it comes with a few changes in the UI, and it also brings trash. And I am going to, I think, try to retrofit this this map with the uh, trash uh, updates. But uh, I'm not going to do that until I have steel operational, and uh, I have the economy uh, secured a lot better. Right, so. So that's going to be an important uh, consideration, right? Uh, and that's one of the reasons I'm considering going to uh, switching off realistic mode and allowing purchasing uh, constructions with, uh, with rubles. Uh, and that is uh, so that I can actually speed some of this along. But it, it's still not going to mean I can just zoom through, right? Uh, the... I'm still going to need to have the rubles to spend, uh, so it, you know it's still going to be some time, right? Uh, but we're just about to retire one loan here, and then another one in ten days. So, uh, like right into the new year, we'll be down to just these ones, right? Uh, which are the long-term ones, and uh, as you can see here. Uh, this number has been going up. 
Now it's partly because of the crop harvest from those fields over there uh, being exported uh, in the fall. Uh, that's, uh, that's not going to make all that much difference for most of the year, uh, but it does help keep the, has helped keep this number, uh, you, you know, from getting too far out. Now we're, we're down to two of the short term loans. And then uh, I think I'll probably just pay off some of these just to get them gone. Yeah, probably. Though I might just go for a 500k short term loan to pay off. Uh, okay. Eh, pay off most of those. Yeah. Or I could just wait for the cash to accumulate and pay them off, right? Uh, like for instance, for this one, um, let's uh, let's pay that one, right? So that's uh, that's less stuff we have uh, monthly, right? Uh, these ones, you know, like we're, we only need a hundred k to uh, pay off these, so. Well, we don't even need 100k. We need. Uh, well, yeah, you got to count the interest, right? Yeah, so a few days, those will get uh, get paid off, right? And uh, that will uh, that will be a uh, an advance, right? Uh, meanwhile, over here, we have stuff getting constructed now. Uh, I have, oh yeah, I'm kind of waiting for uh, a traffic jam to sort of clear there. I do wish you could keep these open along with other ones of these at the same time. That would be a little bit uh, useful, actually. Uh, it's going to take a while to build that pipe, but that's fine. Uh, that can take as long as it wants to. Uh, okay, so I've got a paved road that comes up around this way. Yeah, it's complete. So, no, I think I'll leave the mud road there. Just, uh, just as a... Uh, alternate and a shortcut, right? Um, wait, uh, I haven't put the, I haven't put the signals in here yet. Okay, so I need one of these here and one of these here. Whoops, wrong uh, mouse button, All right? And I need uh, one of these here. Yeah. Yeah, you can't put it in the middle of the road. Yeah. Okay. So if I put one here, oh, that should be a regular signal. Right. And I put one here. And one here, yep. And then I can put yep. Okay. So I have signals there, right? And I need no, I need one there, one of those there one of these here and that needs to be one of those yeah okay i think that that completes the blocking there okay yeah that's uh definitely uh a thing no it's in here 
Uh, right. We got, uh, yeah, a little bit of time left. Let's, uh, let's pay another one of those off. Yeah, I'm just going to use a nice uh, round number there. Uh, you know what? Yeah, I can pay off a couple more of those. Uh, can I get away with another one? Yeah, I think I can. Okay. So that's, uh, that's down to seven loans, uh, soon to be six. Uh, we're down to under one and a half million rubles owed. And that's, uh, that's a pretty good position to be in overall. Okay, all of that sorted out. Uh-huh. Right. So I'm just going to go in here and I'm going to assign some roads. Uh, yeah. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, just assign some stuff so it can get built. Yeah. Yeah, assigning the stuff so it can get built, uh, that means, you know, stuff gets built, right? Uh, now, what's... Um, um Okay. Oh, well, there's plenty of gravel. Okay. Right. I'm just wondering if there was a bottleneck on... Oh, it's on transport, isn't it? Yeah, it probably is. So I have, that's graph, there's only, wait, really? Uh, dumper, capacity, yeah, let's get a few more dumpers in there for the gravel operations. Right, and here we have asphalt operations. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Yeah, get some uh, decent uh, trucks going in the... Uh, in the uh, construction office and then maybe some of that gravel stuff will go a little faster on those roads. Yeah. We've got plenty of gravel production. Might as well, uh, you know, do something with it, right? Yeah. Okay. Good. That's uh, that's a thing that will help. Oh, I kind of wiped out the uh, cash there, but I don't think fatally. Uh, our big uh, big loans, our our expensive loans are gone. So just need one of the big exports to uh, to happen and 
everything will be good. Um, that would be this one. Yeah, that's going to take a minute. Okay. Right. Well, we've got a 90k export coming, so that should sort that out. You know what? Just for giggles, let's uh, let's ride this. Why it switched tracks there, I I have no idea. But, here we go. We are... We are unloading stuff, and... That is getting ahead somewhat. Ah, and we've got coal too, right? Yeah. Right. Right, so this will uh, this will straighten that out. Yep. Okay, well that can uh, that can tick along in the uh, background there. Now let's uh, let's go back up here. Um, we have. Oh yeah. We have we have a gravel truck going somewhere. Yay! We have a gravel truck going somewhere. As it uh, inches its way up the uh, snow-covered road. Now, as annoying as it is, it's actually fairly realistic to have uh, slow travel on the snow-covered roads. Anyone who doesn't live in a snowy climate uh, really doesn't understand how how much that can impact uh, uh, travel. But you know, uh, I think it may possibly impact things both not enough and too much at the same time. Yeah. Uh, on the one hand, uh, travel is slower, and there's uh, plenty of reasons why it uh, it doesn't do uh, well when you've got snow and no snow plowing. But on the other hand, depending on your location, the amount of snow you get isn't really enough to make roads impassable norm normally, right? Okay, yeah. So, so that's going to definitely help out with uh, with speeding up this road construction at the very least. Yeah. Right, okay. Well, that is definitely stuff that is uh, getting done. Yeah. Hmm. Now, I've probably shown this before, but under game settings, um, see, I could turn off realistic mode, right? And if I did that, then I'd have the option of building things. And, uh, you know, for cash. And, you know, it, it feels like cheating, but, you know, the cost is pretty high compared to self-build, right? And, you know, that might not be the uh, absolute worst thing in the world I could do. Okay. 
Oh, the technical services here is going to need a... Uh, it's going to need this guy and this guy, right? Yep. And I'm going to need... Uh, I'm going to need vehicles, but... Uh, but... Yeah, perhaps not uh, not until I have the cash flow. Yeah. Yeah, perhaps not. But anyway, what have I got for... Uh, okay, water. Um... That does 75 carries. Um, put a couple of those in there. And... Yeah, a couple of those too, probably. If I buy them now, they'll have time to get here, right? That's, uh, that's an important factor. Yeah. Uh, but I can't buy too much all at once, right? Because I don't have the rubles yet. Yeah, and this is why, uh, you know, just turning on, on uh, uh, buy for rubles construction doesn't really make necessarily make the game easier, just a little faster, right? And, you know, I do think perhaps that might not be the worst option. Yeah, it might not be. Hmm. Yeah, this is going to take a really long time to build the way I've set this up. So, uh, you know, it might not be the worst uh, worst idea. Then again, um, might make more sense to invest in more choppers another chopper anyway um one two three no i don't have room for another chopper yeah i don't oh you know what i should have in here i should have a have some cranes in here. Hmm. Yeah. I should have cranes in there. Put a couple of cranes in. Hmm. So if I was to buy a mechanism... Excavator, paver, roller. No, I don't have the cranes that I can buy there. Oh, well. That answers that, doesn't it? Yep, yeah, pretty much does. Okay. Well. Okay. So the choppers aren't really doing anything. So if I grab the chopper thing. Okay. That's a store. Right. Get that. 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 
Yeah. Yeah, get these queued up, right? And that. Yeah, build a bunch of those. Yeah, just get the uh, the choppers busy doing something, right? And build that too. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So we got us some uh, chopper action here right so turning off the uh, GUI and sitting here uh, watching we should see some uh, yeah see there's the choppers coming and dropping stuff off yep And a truck going. Yay, it's a truck. Um, you know what? Something else I can do? I could assign... Some of these roads to the choppers, too. Yeah. Oh, I think I might want to try and remove a node there. Yeah, remove a node there. Right, well that's probably enough uh, stuff queued up. The uh, uh, choppers can uh, do this without actual uh, people. We have a fire up here. Oh, that's not going to get put out. Yeah, it's not going to get put out, yeah. Yeah, we'll just get it, uh... Get it, uh, uh re, uh, rebuilt, right? Oh. Maybe we'll make that high priority, you know, just for giggles. Yeah, why not? Uh, this here is on to paving, right? Okay. Now, if we uh, go on into here. Yeah, so we can see here. Yeah, we've uh, increased our imports quite significantly. Yeah, that's what the that's another reason why this is going to take a minute uh, because the uh, the resource uh, exports aren't paying quite enough to keep up with the resource demands for building all of this, right? And that's, uh, that's fine. You know, that's going to be the case. But, uh, you know, it'll take a minute. And then it'll get sorted out, right? But there's um, about three years left on, on, uh, on these loans, right? Uh, and they'll just keep filtering along as uh, time goes on here. Oh yeah, we're bringing gravel up here. Okay. Now, that, okay. I can add uh, some more stuff to the uh, construction queue there. Yep. 
Oh, and I can go in here and I can grab uh, sewage. Two of those. Yeah. Okay. Ah, the fire station. Right. That's uh, it's not built yet. Right. And it won't do much good until I have people up here, or unless I put a, I could put a chopper pad on it. I could. That might not be the worst option. Hmm. I'll have to think about it. Now, how's this... Okay, we've got chunks of pipe built. And chunks still under construction. Yeah, okay. Well... That's going to do a thing. Where is this? It's over here. And there are fire trucks on the way. Yay! Fire trucks on the way. There they are. And there's the fire out. Yay! Well, okay, we've now come up on uh, spring. And that's going to substantially uh, reduce the delays on uh, construction because the traffic will move faster, right? Now, where is... Where are we getting the... We're getting the, cons the construction labor from here. Yeah. Uh, where's the... And you're getting it from here? No, that should be fine. Can I squeeze a couple of uh, bigger buildings in here? Can I squeeze one of these in here? Oh, I can. I kind of like that. Now, can I squeeze it this way? No, I have to squeeze it this way. Uh, okay. So if I do that, I can put two of them in here. But if I put two of them in here, uh, okay, we'll do uh, no. Okay, there. Right there. Okay, so if I do that, can I get a path out of this one? Oh, I can. Okay. Well, if I can do that, I might as well just... Uh, uh, build those. Right. And make these guys high priority. Right? Okay. So, 
yeah, get a couple more uh, uh, residential buildings in range of this, right? Uh, I think that'll make some sort of a impact on something. Wait, can I get a path through here? Or is that... Is, ooh. So I could get a path through here. Yeah. Uh, uh, and, oh, it can connect too. Nice. So just, just wait for that to finish so that, uh, yeah. Okay. And then build that. This can just no. Uh, right, I can take the construction labor off that one. Right. Okay. Now this. Yep, it's going to take a minute, but all of the resources will turn up, and right. So the idea is to take uh, these 255 guys here and actually make them available for actual working, right? Uh, in the meantime, I'm going to go in over here, and I'm going to pay one of those off. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, paying one of those off is, uh, yeah. we're down to under a thousand uh, rubles per uh, per day in debt service. Yeah. So, right, so the loans are going to be gone real soon now. We're, we're, we're paying hardly anything on loans now. Uh, as long as this number here is higher than the 30 days number, uh, we can service the debt, right? And that's the, that's the important bit, right? Um, right, and we've got, ah, it's waiting for asphalt, right, okay. Why is it waiting? Because all the asphalt operations trucks are all... Uh, engaged. Ah, well this road is getting paved, so there's that, I suppose. Yeah. Okay. Now where's my cranes? Oh, that's the flock of cranes. Okay. Well, yeah, that's not the that's not the problem. I do kind of wish it could deliver resources for the next phase while the current phase is is operating right i do kind of wish that but no i didn't want to borrow uh no i want to go in here Yeah, okay, so that's got rid of all of the old loans, right? So now down to under 1.2 million rubles, right? Uh, here we go. Now we're on to the next phase, which is going to be... Uh, 
Uh, prefabs and steel. Right. Well, uh, I think I'm going to... I'm going to check in on this. Um, well, yeah, they're, they're coming. Okay. Yeah, it's delivering them pretty quickly. When the steel arrives, it's going to just explode into uh, uh, production here. Well, that's fine. We can be waiting for the steel. That's not the end of the world. I mean, there's plenty of uh, prefabs needed still. This goes really quick when you've got a stockpile right by the building, right? So that's um, the next uh, big uh, construction projects I get up to. I'll need to... Uh, I'll need to stockpile resources in the area first. Oh, is the steel coming? Yeah, it is. Where is it? Oh, that'll be it. Okay. So this is going to uh, jump into immediate action here. Uh, probably some cranes on the way now. Yeah, there are. Okay, that'll make uh, relatively quick work of it. Yeah, there we go. It's, uh, it's going to finish real quick. And I'm going to assign this one as well. If we can have more workers coming in here, uh, we can produce coal and uh, and everything faster, right? And here we go. This one is done. Okay. So now it, this will fill up basically completely. Yeah. Yeah, and here we go. And now is that... Yeah, I'm kind of hoping that some of them will work over there. But if we get more people over here, that won't be bad either. Okay. So... Yep. That's up to... Building's on fire. Yeah, so it is. Trucks are on the way, though. Yep. Of course there's an electricity problem. The distribution network was on fire. Right, okay. Well... I'm going to I'm going to put a pin in this here. I uh, call this this episode done just after checking in up here where we can see that some additional construction can be enabled up here. Uh, so I will do that right. And we've got got uh oh i can uh, enable that one too right okay good right okay well that's uh yeah that's enough for the moment uh i want to make sure you are assigned yeah yeah. 
And you are assigned. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's going to be that's going to be all for this uh, for this uh, installment. So I'll mention on the way out that I do have a Patreon. Uh, the link will be in the description if you care to support the channel. If not, well, just ignore the link. You know, it'll be there, but you know, you can ignore it or use it. It's up to you. Anyway, uh, that's going to be all for now. So see you back next time.